Hey, welcome. This is Lee Waller. I'm going to take a quick look at image sequences and how to import them and use them. Now, if you're not familiar with an image sequence, it's been rendered out by whoever created the video in a series of single files. So this image sequence right here is specifically a .png sequence made up of a bunch of PNG images. There are other types of image sequences that you might come across, such as JPEG, TIFF, Targa, Bitmap, maybe even a Photoshop file image sequence. But the one that we're looking at today is a .png file format. Now you can see here it starts off at zero and it goes down to about 239. Now I rendered this out as a motion graphic and the reason I did it this way is because it has a transparent background. So I'll show you how to import it in Premiere Pro and then also After Effects. So I'm gonna double click right here in the project panel and I've already navigated to the file. You'll see here, and let me just show you another way of looking at this. Go to list view and you'll see, again, there is that first file starting off at zero and that's the one we want to select. And Premiere will then acknowledge that this is an image sequence. So rather than importing all of these separate, it's going to combine them all together as a video clip. I'm gonna hit open, and there is our image sequence. Now this one again, like I said, the reason I rendered it out is because it has a transparent background, and I'm gonna to need to scale that down. And there's the image, and just to show you this transparent background, I'm gonna drop this blue mat below it and there you can see that this image has a transparent background and that's the whole reason for that png sequence now i'll jump over to after effects and do the same thing i'm just going to double click right here and here is that first image again you see i select it and down here it says format png png sequence i'm going to hit import there and now i can drag that in start a new composition with it and let's see, we'll drop in a new solid real quick. Let's change that color to something we can see. Hit OK on it. And there again, we have that PNG sequence that has a transparent background on it. I hope this has been helpful. For more on Premiere Pro and After Effects, check out my other tutorials.